them start. Let them buy car first. Let them buy their houses first. Let them do everything first. You can start late and still be the latest. You can start okay? late and still be the winner. World. Welcome to my my mom's my mom's blog. So today, why wear a new school uniform? Yeah, they just gave it to us, and I look strong. <laughs> and they gave me a tie. I knotted it, but I cut all those by the way. <laughs> so I think I'll tell this story this time. So hi guys, uh, please in the comment section, please tell me how I look. Thank you. Bye. 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 Check out. <laughs> <laughs> Hey guys, good morning and welcome back to my channel. How are you guys doing? I want to believe that you guys are doing well. Okay, so today I'm here to start off this beautiful vlog. I'm supposed to have started this vlog, so but a lot of um, hinges here and there, but I'm starting it off now. I want to start by showing you guys what I have here. So this morning, I told my husband yesterday that I wanted, I was just craving meat pie. And I told him I'll, I'll be going to the market today, this morning, to go and buy just a little meat, minced meat. Then he now said, this morning, I should come and go. I said, no, the market sellers have not opened by this time, especially meat, that if I need to go, I'll need to go to the slaughter. He was now like, well, let's go to the slaughter. I'm like, no, because when you go to the slaughter, you're going there to buy big meat. I'm not buying big meat. He said, let's go. Maybe they can give us. So we dropped the kids off school. And then we proceeded to go to the slaughter. When we got to the slaughter, uh, I told my customer I wanted meat. He said, how much meat? I was like, 1,000. He's like, no, he cannot sell 1,000 Naira meat now because he's still attending to, uh, what, what are they called? Like, uh, people that buy to sell. I'm not, like, okay, let's be going. He was like, okay, let's buy meat because we don't have meat. The last meat I had in my freezer, I used everything for my marathon cook. So we decided to buy meat. My husband decided to buy the meat. So we got one lap, just like we bought the last time for the occasion we had, one lap of cow. And this is what I have here. Honestly, since I came back, this meat has been here. I'm scared that if it stays any longer, my money might just go to waste. Uh, nobody has money to waste so I'm going to turn this meat so I can start washing it there's a lot of meat here I was carrying this in and the blood poured on my clothes this was not what I was wearing I had to go and change this one quickly I'll pour the, uh, so I can show you what one lap of cow meat and it's a very big uh, so this is what one lap of cow meat as you can see so I found out that the lap has more meat than the cow tail I usually buy so now I think I'm going for the lap and the size the cut it is quite decent as you can see it's a decent size and i'll wash it now store it in my freezer let's do this so i'm happy for this meat because i bought it very fresh before flies will start patching it and I was happy to see that in the market in the slaughter where they cut this meat that they have doctors that come to test if the meat is healthy if the meat if the cow was sick or you know all of that um, check they actually do it and this is my first time seeing it 
and it makes me happy yeah so as you can see i'm seriously covered <laughs> i think the next year somewhat next year but this is going to last me at least till more than this year of course so yeah i'm happy so can you guess how much we bought a full cow tail i would have shown you the video and shown you the you would have seen the video and the particular cow i mean cow lap it's called the lap though not tail because i found out that the cow tail has a lot of cow skin and the meat is not much so but this one has more meat honestly and the difference is not much so guys i'm done washing the meat okay this is it with salt wash it with salt it's very important i'm going to be using this um, freezer bags to freeze this meat okay so i've had this bag for a very long time i think this is the this is going to be the end of summer Monday. so i'm going to be packaging bagging it individually so how i pack it i'll pack according to um how i cook okay so if i'm going to be making like um because the sizes are the sizes are okay if i'm going to be making like four pots of soup i'm going to just pack it per pot and then i'm also going to be packing in normal cellophane bags in case i just want to whip up something that's how i'm going to pack the meat okay pieces of meat so if i'm making a pot of soup 20 pieces of meat is even a lot just for my family yeah so we are done we are done it's time to get our um dough ready roll mm, and here our meat pie guys i'm done um with my meat or with the meat the cow's meat so I'm done packaging it as you can see I'm going to be using this bucket because you guys know I have two meat buckets I used one to pack in my crayfish in the freezer and the other one I use it in storing something else and I found that that my meat, that meat bucket takes space in my freezer like this okay so I need this one I'm going to be using this one because it's going to save me space because it's going to stay like this and then save me some more space because I still have other things I'm going to buy to pack up so what i did was the bag i showed you guys could not was not enough i had to use this little cellophane so i packed this little cellophane 15 pieces of meat each okay so that's what i packed here and then for the for this freezer bags i packed 20 so let's count and see how many we managed to get count now 20 20 i packed here so two Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So twenty times ten, eleven, twelve. Now this this is another reason I prefer using this bucket because that other bucket will not take up and still you know it will just like overflow then this one is 15 each we have two of here for 20 pieces and then we have 15 now one two three four five six so 15 times six this one was what was left this is about eight pieces and here I can cover this and keep it nicely in my freezer and that makes me so happy what do you guys think
Can you see? Woo! That is amazing! It's so good. Thank you guys. 